All right, guys, welcome to the Chelsea Fan Channel. This is my Sunday Expresso review. As you can see, I'm at home again, and I just wanted to really recap on the amazing weekend that the Blues had. Uh, obviously, we won 4-0 at Villa Park. I know it was only Aston Villa guys, but I think earlier on in the season, we actually probably would have only won that game by one or two goals. And I think the main reason we excelled at Villa Park was basically because we played a completely different team. And what is most important is we played our new signings, we played our youth. Ruben Loftus-Cheek is doing absolutely amazing. I mean, I think, to be honest, I think every Chelsea fan, we want him, we want him to be the next sort of JT, want him to be the next sort of leader because he's the last sort of standing, I think, because obviously if JT doesn't get a renewed contract, we do need somebody who really has a lot of heart and soul and feels for the game, and I definitely feel like he does. Uh, and also, obviously, Pato coming on and scoring a debut goal is also amazing. And I just, I mean, I suppose it's confusing for every Chelsea fan as to why he hasn't been played earlier. Uh, but again, I think Gus came in to do a job. He came in to study the ship and he did that. And now he feels like, you know, we, there isn't a trophy to win, but we can still get into Europa League. So maybe he's just trying to mix things up a bit and it's actually really working. I thought Pedro was great, obviously, getting some goals. I, I just think, you know, as a team, we are really doing well at the moment. Mikel obviously is... <laughs> They call him the African Zidane, don't they? He's absolutely brilliant. I mean, I'd, I think he's been really underestimated since he's been at Chelsea. And I think this season he's just shown that he really is a major part of our team. Yeah, OK, fine. It can get a bit defensive sometimes. But I think as an overall, Chelsea need him. We need him to stay. And I feel like he definitely has a few more years with us. And he definitely has a very specific role that not many other players could fill. Uh, yeah, guys. So, you know, it was just a great weekend. And I'm really looking forward to our next set of fixtures. I mean, obviously, we've got quite a lot of... Important games coming up. We can still get into Europa League. I mean, obviously Tottenham at home is going to be a big game for us, not just the rivalry, but in general, we still need to get three points. We can still get into Europe, guys. So let's be positive. It was a brilliant game at the weekend and I absolutely cannot wait to see how we're going to play the rest of the season because it really got me excited, guys, to be honest. Everyone thought the season was over and I am now absolutely buzzing to watch the rest of it. And hopefully we can just pick up next season with a new manager and excel even more. So yeah, guys, I'm going to see you all super soon. Come on, you blues.